First, California residents voted down a measure to legalize pot. California, can you believe it? They said, no, don't legalize pot. California. Now, the Obama administration says marijuana does not have any medicinal purposes. Dale Sky Jones from the Oaksterdam University, live with us from San Francisco. Dale, those two points t seem to me to be big hits against legalization of marijuana. Your organization, which teaches how to grow it and market it, you taking a hit. Well, frankly, states are taking a hit. This is a states' rights issue, and the federal government seems to want our states, who are already heavily burdened, to take on the responsibility of a failed prohibition policy, a very costly one. We're approaching 40 years of a failed drug war, and we would have the states bear 98% yeah. of this, didn't you when think the states just simply want their rights to regulate I, itself. But didn't you think that California voters, of all people, would surely go for legalization of marijuana, but they didn't? And uh, wouldn't you think that well, the Obama administration, of all administrations, would, would see the medicinal value of marijuana? I mean, what's going on? Well, it seems we didn't ask quite the right question, which is why we're working towards a coalition for cannabis policy reform in 2012. However, back to the Obama administration, you know, the Department of Health and Human Services would disagree. They've held a couple of patents on both the antioxidant and neuroprotective qualities of cannabis. The reality is the DEA is continuing to criminalize the plant while the pharmaceutical companies struggle and fight to create the pill as fast as they possibly can. I'm just this surprised. is about jobs. I, 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 look, I see your point, but it just seems to me like you're struggling uphill when I thought you'd be coasting home. But I've got one more issue for you. I want to ask you about these Chrysler workers who were caught on videotape. I think you've seen it. They were smoking pot on the job before they went to work and during their lunch break. Um, now, you wouldn't recommend that, now would you? No, not at all. And in fact, many of these rules are in place in employment to keep people safe, both themselves while they're on their job and also the public around them. So it's important, whether it be cannabis, alcohol, or any of these prescription drugs, if someone is under the influence where it could affect safety, they should be held accountable for this. And this is part of why we need to regulate and take these types of things out of the hands of criminals and put it into yeah. the hands of regulated folks. But I think there's, there's a lot of public condemnation about workers who they see on videotape doing this. And I, th I think it's another hit for you guys in the pro-legalization segment. I think you'd have to agree with that. Only if it's framed that way. I, I disagree. It really depends, Stuart, on how we frame this issue because they were also drinking on the job and drinking is legal. We really have to take this issue as an adult issue. Yep. Stop putting people in prison and start educating them. And frankly, they should be held accountable if they were drinking on the job just as much as if they were using cannabis or using prescription drugs that would put other people in danger. I think we're with you and we appreciate you being with us. As always, Ms. Sky Thank Jones. Thank you so much. No, thanks for being with us. Ellis, I, we didn't can get I, into that. Go I ahead. Can I help you with one thing? So you refer yep. to California taking a hit and these people taking a hit. There is a slang that is used when talking about taking a hit. Oh, wow. That means, did you realize that? No, or I didn't. Or was that an accidental <laughs> double entendre? It was a pun, a double entendre, and I didn't realize okay, it. I I'm just sorry. wanted to make sure you But knew. aren't you surprised? And you, Tracy? <laughs> it, it's yeah, strange. Daily, it daily, I, don't, I don't think she's still on camera, but she's laughing at my uh, double entendre. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. She's, she's laughing, she's laughing. She's taking the microphone off. But look, aren't you surprised that yeah. in California, yeah. They said no to legalization, and the Obama administration says, oh, no, there's no medicinal value to it. Doesn't that shock you? Oh, absolutely. I mean, and I've heard nothing else. The dollars and cents of it. The tax revenue alone the could sense? help solve our problem. As in sense of me,